What is it? Mr. President, General Morgan, we have a situation developing in Seattle. A situation, General? Communications have been sketchy. But it appears that Russian troops have managed to sneak into port using disguised cargo ships. Well, let me get this clear. You're saying that we have Soviet soldiers on American soil, General? That we've been invaded? Yes, sir. It seems more are coming in. Uh, we have precious few units in the area, and they're putting up what resistance they can. My god. What are our options? They're rather limited, sir. If we start pulling divisions back from Europe, we'll lose what control do we- I know, I know. But don't we have anything to defend our own country with? I've ordered what units that we have to go west, sir. Who's leading them? A Colonel Sawyer, sir. He's as tough as they come. Well, he better be. Assemble the staff. Situation room, 20 minutes. Very well, Mr. President. We fled east with the darkening sky behind us lighted by the many fires downtown. Some have later called the retreat organized, but I think it only seemed that way because we were all running in the same direction. Seattle was lost the moment those ships entered the harbor, and there was never any real chance of our holding the city. I try not to think about all those we were forced to leave behind. Captain Bannon kept us in a semblance of order, but I'll never know whether we were actually obeying his commands or they just happened to coincide with what we all thought best. We followed the freeway into the suburbs with the war close on our heels. Some artillery had already landed in the area and I remember seeing a broken swing set lying on its side next to a blackened crater. I think that was when it hit me. We had been invaded and nothing would ever be the same again. Wow, that's a lot of people. They better get a move on or the commies will pound them to pieces. I guess it's on us to protect them, damn civvies. Wonder when Colonel Sawyer will get here. We need the reinforcements, but I could do without him. Continue toward the bridgehead, Parker. Get some defenses up by the freeway. Won't be long before the commies get here. Get a move on, Parker. We need to get these positions up ASAP. Looks like the commies have caught up with us, people. Some Russian scouts have been spotted not far from here. Nothing to be worried about yet, but I get the feeling more are on the way. What do you want, sir? The perimeter needs to be taken now. God damn it! They're here already! Return fire! And remember, we don't have any reinforcements to call on, Parker! Bradley Infantry Transport ready. Troop carrier waiting for orders. Parker, the Russians have gathered a lot of civilians at some houses not far from here. Now they're putting them on school buses. We have to get to them before the commies take them away. Bomber transport reporting. Tracks are moving. Bradley firing from position. That's the spirit, Parker. Get him! Kill all of them so we can get those civvies out of there. Bomber transport. 
Parker, at least you can do something right. Eagle Six to Captain Bannon. Give me a sit rep. Bannon here. We're engaged at the bridge and we're trying to get a bunch of civilians out of the area before the Russians come in force. Come in, Parker. Russian infantry has been sighted near a house belonging to General Levinson. I just talked to him. His family is still there and they must be evacuated before it's too late. I wonder where those bastards got his address. Yes, sir. APC moving out. Understood, Captain. Get those civvies across. We're moving into the area now, and I can call in some fire support for you. Roger that, sir. Parker, we have to hold the bridgehead while the buses move across. Don't let any Russians through. What is it you want us to do, sir? Okay, people, this is how we'll do it. Parker, you deal with the ground forces as best you can. Bannon, if you see any units that Parker can't handle, radio their position to me, and I'll relay it to the artillery. The school buses carrying the evacuees have started moving across the bridge, Colonel. Good. Don't let the Russians through. They're using helicopters to drop troops on our side, but we'll make sure the road is clear. Eagle Six, out. That chopper crashed. I'm airlifting reinforcements to your position, Parker. Make good use of them. In the woods to the north! I reach you, Captain. Target Mart. What do you want us to to push and shoot that target? Don't you know any tactics at all, Parker? Retake that position, damn it! Armor! Approaching from the northwest! I've got your target coordinates. Fire support incoming. Stay low. Sheridan ready for orders. Keep that missile locked. Another missile going to be armed. Parker, Ivan is sending a large amphibious force across the lake. Be prepared. They're firing at us. Good, everyone. 
The buses are almost across. Message received. Good call, Captain. near the bridgehead in 10. Here he comes. Lieutenant Parker. Good to see you alive. And Captain Bannon. Seems I can't get rid of you. Seems that way, Colonel. Well, from what I gathered, you did a decent job in organizing the retreat, but I'm prepared to let bygones be bygones. <laughs> Screw up again, though, and you'll pay. I won't, Colonel. We'll see. This is Captain James Webb, and this is First Lieutenant Parker and Captain Bannon. They fought with me in Europe. Hey, it was tough going over there. Sorry I missed it. <laughs> you shouldn't be. We need to see about blowing that bridge so the Russians don't roll over it. Get back to your units. We'll take it from there. You there! What's your unit? Washington National Guard, sir. We were don't matter. I need an orderly and you're in. Get your stuff. We're moving. Go on, man. Now, soldier. Bannon, what the hell were you thinking fortifying that position? Sir, it was Parker who... Never mind. We can use a forward position there to delay the Soviet main force when it arrives. That would be the perfect job for you and your tanks, Bannon. Get over there now. Yes, sir. Bannon out. Webb and Parker, Ivan's gonna come down that freeway like a cannonball on fire, and we have to delay him long enough for the bridge to be blown. If we let his heavy armor get across, the entire state will fall before we know it. Understood? Affirmative, sir. Come on, Parker. We'll dig in on the other side. Parker, I'm leaving some of our reserves to you. Call in what reinforcements you need. Good going, Parker. Now get those shovels out. This is Eagle 6. It looks like we're gonna be here for a while. I've contacted the Air Force to see if they can help us blow the bridge, but they've failed to respond so far. Sir, can't we just leave that bridge and get out of here? If we do, Washington State is lost, Bannon. I thought I made that clear. You are to hold until told otherwise, Captain. Understood, sir! Your reinforcements are on the way, Parker. They'll be landing shortly. Stay clear of the area. Lieutenant Parker, we have to do something about those Soviet helicopters. I just got a line on some out-of-service anti-air batteries in the area. If you could fix them up, we might get rid of those choppers once and for all. This is Eagle 6. Good job. Now hold them back while I see about getting that bridge below sea level. Want somewhere, sir? Ready to drive. We got him, Starting sir. with the repairs. They're firing at us. Enemy We're just taking out those pairs now! We're targeting. Unit lost. Enemy lost the choice. This is Bannon! How long are we supposed to stay here by ourselves? Until I say so, Captain. You should be happy to be here considering what you have to answer for. Now focus on killing the enemy. Affirmative, sir! Bannon out! You've got casualties. We finally got some air defenses up. See if you can fix the rest of them, Parker. The commies are so damn fast! They must have dropped airborne units all over the city! We'll be cut off if we stay here much longer! Can't we drop that bridge now? I'm seeing to that, Captain. Now stay in place and calm down! Good to see 
see those AA guns back in action, Lieutenant. Unit carrier waiting for orders. Engine is running, sir. Starting with the repairs. Looks like they're cutting us some slack, Parker. But stay focused. I bet more of them are coming our way. Enemy target destroyed, We're sir. Available for Parker, the local hospital hasn't been evacuated yet, and Ivan is closing in. Get over there and set up a perimeter while they finish the evacuation. Webb will have to hold the bridgehead by himself in the meantime. Not a problem, Colonel. Hurry up, Parker. They need your help. A lot of civilians won't get out of the city in time. I think those civvies are in for some rough times, Colonel. Yeah. We must try to evacuate as many as possible. Our air defenses are fully functional again, and Ivan has ceased sending his choppers into the area. All thanks to you, Parker. Excellent job. You're the man, Parker. I got an M60 tank attached to my company, but you probably need it more than we do. I'll tell those men you're in command instead of me. Bomber transport reporting in. Parker, Ivan is dropping airborne troops at several different locations, but our scouts have pinpointed their rally points. Put some shells on those targets, Lieutenant. Russian airborne infantry spotted, Parker. They've dropped behind our position. Use artillery or whatever you have, Parker, but make sure Ivan doesn't get organized or will be hard put to defend this bridge. You got him running, Parker. Move on to the next target. The evacuation is underway. Secure the position and hold until it's complete. This is Zulu Niner. Order strike completed. Target coordinates are way off. Orders hit nothing. Hostile defeated. What do you want us to do, sir? Fire that missile! Good shot. Keep it on. Take that perimeter. You lost a unit. Copy. Zulu Niner firing orders. Another rally point they won't be gathering at. Well done, Lieutenant. Not many left, Parker. You're doing well. Target Parker, good job. That was the last of them. Well done, Lieutenant. Eagle Six, Eagle Six, we're under heavy attack. I got commies all over the place. Looks like the whole Soviet army needs backup now. Calm down, Captain. Parker will call in fire support for you. Stay in place, and he'll help you deal with the attack. Roger that, sir. 
Parker, Webb will take temporary command of your forces while you focus on using all available fire support to halt Ivan's attack. The Air Force will bomb the bridge, but we have to hold until they get here. Parker, don't bother with knocking out those rally points now. The Russians have already dispersed. We can expect a lot of ambushes from here on. Hell yeah! Take that, you commie bastard! On target, Lieutenant. Keep it coming. Got it. The enemy airstrike is inbound and designated for orbit. substations and the like. Ivan might have taken Seattle, but we won't make it easy for him. A perfect artillery hit. Whoa! That's some explosive. That's what I want to see, Parker! Scorched Earth! Parker! Where the hell is that fire support? My people can't handle this by themselves! The target area has been turned to death, including hospital. Call in the fire danger close, Parker! We can take it! Down, shells on the way. Good work with the coordinates. Lieutenant, the Russians are throwing everything they have into the attack. Call in fire support now! First platoon clear! Second platoon, start moving! There's so goddamn many of them! We need all the fire support we can get, Parker! More, you hear? Ban it out! It's insane! We have to fall back faster! There are thousands of civilians behind us trying to get away. If we fall back now, they're gonna get caught in the fight. Do you want that to happen? But there's too many of them! You've faced worse odds before, haven't you? He's right, Bannon. Now pull yourself together. I... I will, Colonel! It's gonna take a while to rebuild. Yeah. What's that thing? This, my friend, is a portable CD player. Portable? Yeah. Really? Yeah. What's the sound like? I'd show you, but the batteries are dead. I wish I could find some new ones. 
Let's see if we can get a ride back to the rallying point. Yeah, I need to oh, get back damn. to HQ. 